I'm Technically Alex, and today's video is just a super quick tip about how to get everyone on Discord to be the same volume, which is super great because you know what happens when one person starts talking and they're too quiet and another person starts talking and they're too loud and you gotta mix them together in Discord and it's just a nightmare. You don't wanna have to deal with it. So today's tip, it's the silver bullet, baby. I guarantee it. Your life's gonna be so much better once you do this. The only caveat is that you're gonna need a separate audio device that's just for Discord. And you can achieve this by having a hardware mixer or interface like a GoXLR, or you can use software like voice meter and virtual audio cables to do it. I don't recommend doing it in software. Do it in hardware, buy yourself a nice mixer. But if you can't, software will work too. Either way, what you wanna do is tell Discord to send all of its audio to one device that's separate from your system audio. So I have everything going to the chat channel on my GoXLR, and then my system audio up here is where all of my games and music and stuff go. Set that up in Discord, and then open the Windows Sound Properties panel, and select the same device you have in Discord in this panel, and then go to Enhancements. And here, all you have to do is check Loudness Equalization, hit OK, and you're done. That's it, that's all you gotta do. And basically what this does is it has Windows apply a normalizer filter to the output device itself. So no VSTs, no plugins, no additional software, no glitches, no hitches. I've been running this for years without a single issue. Now I know some of the audio folks out there are gonna say, but Alex, you're supposed to do stuff like normalization in post-production. And that's a totally valid point that I agree with. However, this is a quality of life improvement that extends way beyond making YouTube or Twitch content. This is just like a sanity improvement for just using Discord. I don't understand why Discord doesn't have a volume normalizer built into it. I don't understand why they force you to manually adjust everyone's volume, especially considering how popular Discord is and everyone has different microphones and different setups, so they all have different volume levels and stuff. This is the solution. This is what you've been looking for. You're gonna stop tearing your hair out trying to match everyone's volume together in Discord, and that's it. That's all you gotta do, and you're gonna be good to go. So if you found this tip useful or helpful, let me know in a comment. Otherwise, thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe for more videos like this in the future, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.